Hello everyone, my name is Jack, and welcome back to a brand new Minecraft video, where today we are back on Realms with the boys. And, uh, as you can see, we have a little, we have a gonkin over here. I'm not sure if he knows I'm here yet, but he, I <laughs> he's totally just right there. He has no idea I'm here. See if this will get his attention. What the heck is he doing? Is he waiting for something to smell? I can't tell. Oh no, he's putting on armor. Oh my god! Until he completely has not seen me right now. Okay, we're just gonna patch that up. That is hilarious. He totally cannot. He has not seen me right now. He has no idea I'm here. That's actually kind of funny. He's gonna throw down an iron nugget. Knocking us. I'm just in this chest. Wait, I'm g I want to see if he notices that there's just a random open chest. Oh my god, I'm right there and he just doesn't notice. Hello! Hi! Recording. For fun. <laughs> hi, hi. <laughs> hey, hey, world. Yes. So anyway, this is Gus's little hobbit hole, right here. It's very small, um, but it seemed to be abandoned due to the fact that I have I sold him. I have I've sold him. I have sold Gus. Sound. I have sold Gus a hobbit hole for himself. So he will be he'll be moving all of his stuff soon. I assume. Um, so yes, I have, in fact, built him a hobbit hole, and he has paid me 32 iron, I didn't do anything. Some reason, I don't 
So let's go take a look at the house that Gus has bought from me. Um, and you know, just like do a little house tour. Um, and I think I think you'll like how it turns out because I actually I'm really proud of it. Uh, it took me it took me like all day yesterday and a bit today to build and this part's this isn't my this isn't well I did build this this uh is a future prod this is a just a little thing I made uh this is not the house you bought for me but uh it is for sale by the way um to any to any people who's on who are on the server and watching this that house is for sale for a low low price of 32 iron just as the other one was as well. The other one is as well. Well, the other one was because Gus bought it. Um, so if we go all the way, it's. I had to find a good cliff face for it because obviously Gus was Gus was making a hobbit hole, so I made him a hobbit hole. I know, I'm recording. So, um, yeah, we have a lot of exciting content to go over. I'm sorry for not uploading lately, but I just decided to take a little break after, um, after, uh, we beat the Ender Dragon. Uh, we got the, we got the Elytra. Uh, I'm pretty sure I didn't know that. I'm not sure if I kept that on camera or not. But we did eventually find an, Elyt an Elytra or Elytra or whatever you want, however you want to say it. I don't care. This is the place that Gus has bought from me. You do, in fact, enchant everything's included. You do get enchant. You do, do get level 30 enchants. Does come with the anvil. And a little, just a, just, just a small bit of decoration. I didn't go really overboard. Probably could use a couple more logs, but, um. There we go. Um. But yeah, we got nether portals on either side that are not linked up, but I will do that eventually, or Gus can do that himself. Um, we got a little rose on a flower pot next to the bed. We got this beautiful view of literally nothing, but I intend to I intend to construct a terraforming business and potentially terraform the area around here so that you don't just have a horrible, horrible looking view. There's a slime chunk somewhere in this area, and I don't know where. Give me those slimy balls. Give me those slimy balls. That should be all of them. Now you're probably wondering what it looks like from afar. I can't really show you because obviously swamps suck. Like, really suck. And that is definitely true. But it looks something like this. And I actually am very proud of of the outside of this. I think it looks very good. Um, yeah. So that's just about it. Um, obviously you're probably wondering if that monstrosity up there is. You wanna shoot me? Oof. Jeez, my leading sword could have gotten some arrows off that, but that's fine. Uh, also, I enchanted this with Smite 3, so... Not bad, hoping to get Smite 5 soon, but it is good for now, and, um, yeah, it's basically all for the houses part, but you're probably actually, yeah, so you're wondering what this is. This is a work in progress creeper farm, uh, definitely 100% work in progress, we have done nothing up here. I'm pretty sure Liam and I just, like, built half of it one day. And like base then never built the rest. For some reason the uh the actual 
the thing, the uh, soul sand doesn't propel you up all the way. And I'm still unsure as to why. But it does do that. So anyway, actually from up here you can almost, I'm not sure if I cranked up my render distance like a lot. Then might be able to see it, but anyway, a little bit of chunks to load. It feels like I can actually see less with higher chunk values than I can normally. Not sure if that's normal or not. Yeah, you can't um, see it over there. Okay, let me turn my render distance back down. Down to 24. No, it's fine. 25 is fine. So anyway, let's head back up to the top. Back to where we were originally. This was where it was. Okay. I am supremely lost. Let me get more air. Um, so over there, the chunks will decide to be agreeable, which they are apparently not. Um, we made a little, little, tiny little hole, like just a little underground base. Okay, and this does nothing except open a trap door. So over there, I just made a little hole in the ground, and over there, I made a little hole in the side of the mountain. Um, but that's. Not really what we're here for, is it? Uh, so this is a work in progress creeper farm. Uh, eventually, it'll supply rockets for the entire server. Obviously, if you're a rocket shop, we're not going to give it out for free. Um, but we I don't think there's a single shop set up on the server right now. We have a little bee farm. Bees are cute. Okay, apparently someone's been down to my village area. Okay, good. All of our villagers are fine. Um, yeah, for some reason, I, I feed these guys every day, but I can't, I can't figure, I can't figure it out. Hey, Gus. Can you come? Hey, Gus. No. <laughs> okay. Neither am I. I think we need more beds, but I'm not sure. Because I feed them all the time. But for some reason, they won't breed. Tori, I still messes up this fight with the whole thing again. Well, yeah, I know, right? It's so difficult. Villagers are the most annoying thing in Minecraft. And that's a fact. Now, we need an anvil. Now, um, I have a bit of news. I am, in fact, going to be joining the 2B2T server due to a extreme amount of boredom. I really have nothing else to do. Wanted to try something new. I think anarchy servers could be fun, and I think it could make for a great city. Um, I already have a couple plans in place. I intend... Uh, if, if, with enough time, this is going to take years, by the way, years and years and years. Um, but I intend to potentially start reconstruction of 
uh, Arius City, which was, I just think that would be cool. Um, and just in general, uh, I don't want to be a griefer because of trash of griefing and not really good at Minecraft in general. I mean, obviously, I can make pretty good stuff. I can make that and that and that and that. Well, I didn't make that. I didn't make that. Did not make this. This is a monstrosity that Liam created, and I think it looks like horrible trash. Um, I mean, I, I made that little nether portal in the, the hub, the, the little underground place, and the hot and the hobbit hole in the side of a mountain over there. Um, so, yeah, not exactly sure. Um, no, I'm not, I say, I'd say I'm a good builder, but I'm not the best. Um, uh, but I'm actually, considering the amount of time I spend playing Jurassic Craft, um, I actually do have a lot, in fact, I have a lot of, oh, what's the word? I can't remember, uh. I don't, I don't know, really. I have a lot of experience playing in older versions of Minecraft. Um, c like, I have, of course, like, I have, of course, because I play Jurassic Craft and I play other mods all the time, so I'm used to playing in 1.7.10, um, and 1.12, and 1.12 is where 2BT, is the update that 2BTT is currently on, although I'm, s but, although apparently when, when 1.16 comes out, they're gonna s jump jump update so yeah that's that's gonna be neat um but yes i will eventually hopefully in the near future be joining 2b2t and i think that's gonna be really fun um yeah and uh that's basically all for that news um didn't really have uh, much to talk about in this video really um it was just kind of an update video. I would have prepared more content, but I'm bored out of my skull and can't be bothered to. Um, it was quarantine. Everything is so boring because of demonetization virus. Yes, that's what I'm gonna have to call it, because otherwise I'll get stranded. Yeah, okay, anyway. I'm just gonna... Not, I'm just gonna... Stop recording, say thanks, and goodbye. Um, hope you're looking forward to 2B2T. I certainly am. I think rebuilding Arya City will be a really fun project. Especially if we can get a, if, if we can get it, if we can get a backup of the server from before Arius was destroyed. Then we could possibly rebuild it almost exactly as it was. So anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Remember to subscribe and hit the bell um, so you never miss another Realms with the Boys video. Thank you so much, and I'll see you all in the next video. See ya!